Neptune Perez, and I'm an astrophysicist, and this is what is Neptune's weather conditions. So Neptune has some very extreme weather. It's nothing that we can even think of here on Earth. It's very different, so let's not compare them. Um, the temperatures in Neptune fluctuate a lot. I mean, Neptune is the furthest planet from the Sun, is the eighth planet from the Sun. Therefore, the temperatures are rigid cold. I mean, some of the temperature in Neptune can get to minus 350 degrees Fahrenheit. The top of the cloud, if it's being heated by some internal source or the, or the sun, it can get up to 50 degrees Fahrenheit. So as you can see, the, depending on where you are on Neptune, the temperature can fluctuate a lot. And here on Earth, one of the things that we see, if there's large uh, temperature fluctuations, we tend to get storms, fronts, all these things. Well, similar things can, I guess, happen in the atmosphere of Neptune. So the atmosphere of Neptune is about 80% uh, hydrogen, 19% helium, and then it has about 1% of, a little bit over 1% of methane with other traces, such as like ammonia, sulfide, all this stuff. Uh, actually, the blue color of Neptune comes from the methane, as methane has an absorption band in the red end of the spectrum. So it absorbs all the red wavelengths, all the orange, all the yellow, and reflects the blue, this, therefore the planet looks blue. Now, um, it does have a lot of clouds, and the clouds are made mostly out of ammonia ice. So, ammonia ice clouds. Now, uh, a while back we were able to observe the Great Dark Spot. The Great Dark Spot is, is kind of an amazing anticyclonic storm that we have on, ne on Neptune. And what's amazing about it is that we've never seen wind speeds like we have in the Great Dark Spot. The wind speed is about 1,500 miles per hour. That is so much larger than we have observed in anywhere in the solar system. So by far, it has the most violent storm. The storms come from uh, differential temperature. So like if one layer is really hot and the other one is very cold, it creates this storm. So the actual great dark spot comes from differential temperatures. And as you can see, it's actually very common to see these large fluctuations within Neptune. My name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is what are the weather conditions on Neptune.